Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Nice strike to the midsection glances. Oh, big left. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. They continue to exchange. Nice knee there, DC. Great job finding the opportunity to land that strike. And they separate. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Ooh. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Oh, he leads with a power right hand there, DC. That'll work. Really sat down with that right hand. That right hand hurt him a little bit. And he comes through with a big knee. Knee to the body. Now a knee. And he's another huge knee. Oh, beautiful level change. Oh, John, that was so nice. What a beautiful takedown. Man, the submission attempts keep on coming. Going for a choke now. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground tonight. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Oh, worked hard to get up again, but he looks like he's compromised. Oh, there you go. Yep, slept him right there. Just over two minutes to go in round one. Back mount now. Under the neck. Oh, and now he flattens him out, DC. A couple hooks in. This could be trouble. Look at all that hip pressure he has into his opponent's back. Now he'll start to rain down brutal ground and pop. And you better intelligently defend here. This could be the beginning of the end. Gets up again here, but hurts his big head kick. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Keeping busy here on the clinch with the knees. He just landed a nice left hook there, I, I feel. Muay Thai flop. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing. Man, what a connection right there. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. He's seeing Tweety Bird over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly leg. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Nice hook. And now he lands a combination. Oh, straight right. Single collar tie. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? 20 seconds left. Oh, he's got it. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he is trying to chase down that.
got clipped. You were wobbled, but you're tough. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other side. All right, round two. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Nice. Four punches. Oh, is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. Oh, another huge knee. Oh, straight right. Visibly limping here. Cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Now he's got the Muay Thai block. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he mixed it all up. Great punch. Trying to establish that jab once again. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Oh, beautiful takedown by him there as he lands another one. He's keeping the stat guys busy tonight. I mean, over and over, takedown. Trying to get that arm underneath the chin. there on the ground. Unbelievable position change. Wow, what a transition. Bottom fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. All right, side control now, DC. You know he's in his element on the ground. A lot of tricks up his sleeve. A lot of tricks. Let's get the side. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Try to get the finish. Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now the ground and pound starts. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the ground. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. Oh, lands another shot to the body. Beautiful. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. Shoot over. Let's see if he can capitalize and lock up the set. You got to try to find whether or not you're going to land. Ground and pound here or if you're going to go to submission. Job to reverse position on the ground. It was bad, but now it's not so bad. What a fantastic sweep. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Nicely done there as he forces the miss from his opponent. And both guys really throwing with authority. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab, take him down, cut him, take him down, cut him. Over and over, he's securing these takedowns. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Potentially working on a leg attack here, DC. It looks like he's attacking a heel hook. Oh, wow, oh! Strong bottom work here, staying busy. And this might just be a matter of time. Brilliant 
submission defense there. A little single collar tie there. And they set. Liver kick. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Big parts land. All right, so again, we find ourselves here in the clinch where there are obviously no shortage of subtleties and nuances, a lot of motions in here that maybe are lost on the casual fan. Absolutely, and it's gonna be the underhook for all the things that happen in this position. The person winning and controlling the underhook battle is the one out of here. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants to get the desired finish. Third round underway. Nice loop and punch. Oh, over the top, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. Well, he's got his back now. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Punch is blocked. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of himself into those strikes to the head. All right, single collar tie now. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Judo throw, he ends up in side control. A lot of options for him here. Yeah, he can either go ground and pop, or he can chase submission. Oh, how about the speed on that reversal there? I mean, I know you can get out of some bad spots, but not with that type of speed. You cannot allow him to get leverage on the bottom. What a sweep. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Man, this is some serious ground and pound here, DC. He's not just staying busy for the sake of staying busy. These strikes are doing damage. Oh, yeah. No pity pat to this guy. Ah. This guy's trying to land, and he's trying to land effective strikes. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape, or maybe look for a Kimura here. Beautiful movement, hip work on the ground here, just outstanding with the transition. He is not staying in one place on the ground, and that's very important. Back to the feet now. Takes him down. All right, so he postures up here, and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming, and before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot. Bruce Buffer has your decision.